what's up guys okay today uh, i will show you how to run your apps in, uh, on you over your network on android studio the simplest way okay and down so to get started you we, we need to go we need to close our android studio okay to accept to get the access of over our plugins we we'll go there on browser repositories we will search mm, to android wi-fi adb okay we will have uh, or in moment do i have i make this video we have uh, one two three four four options okay we will install the last option okay the last one we click installs this will install our plugin to get ready to use i think that the, it, it, this we, we will take a while okay so i will pause, pause the video and the return when it it is finished. Okay, the the the, the install was finished, so I will s I will click here to restart the Android Studio. Okay. Okay, we can find it there and click restart again. No, I think that uh, it will not restart. So I will reopen under the studio. Just close and open it again. Okay. So under the studio is open it and uh, now I will show you how to to use that that plugin i will open any app sample that i i have built just to to demonstrate it to run it on my device okay once the project is loaded you can see now the right the right hand on your right and on right of your android studio uh, the adb wi-fi tab okay you can click and you will see a message that say no device connected that is that is because we i i have no device connected over usb on my computer okay you can open it by clicking by clicking here okay so now i will connect my my phone over USB just note that the USB is just for first setup okay every first setup you need to connect your device over USB now I will show you you will see there my device okay connected over USB I will connect it now okay okay my, my device is connected now and you can now see that the device is is recognized on this tab okay if you tab not, does not appear here you can just uh, go to view and the tool windows and you can find the android wi-fi at the back tab you can just click and you will see there now for every device that you connected uh, by wife by USB, you will you will see there on this tab listed here, and you can just click connect. Okay. Now uh, I will try I will disconnect my device over USB. Okay. Okay, I disconnected my device over USB and the device is kept it connected. Okay. 
I will try to run this this sample up. Okay, and my device my device is here. I will show you. Note that my visor visor application is connected over Wi-Fi wi -fi 2 Okay, is there my IP and my and the port? And I click view to open to to view my my device on my computer screen. It will show a uh, 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 this. Just ignore. And I will run the app. You can see you can see over my my device tab that there is no there is no USB connected. Okay. It is my it is my tab. It is tab of my device. Okay, there is no USB connected, and now I I will run my app on my device. okay it's five finished so you can see that the my usb is not connected so it is very simple and is and there is the app, app uh, the application sample that uh, i run over the android studio now i will click it to terminate the application okay that's it people not the if you like the video hit uh, the hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for to more videos to come is to okay and uh, see you in the next video bye